Cheers. It's Ron Vira here. Ah, blood's so good. And all of you know the original Ron Vira is from New Orleans. And it's Halloween time. And I'm going to be cooking up some Cajun delights for you. In the meantime, I have a very special guest. All the way from Broadway, Lavingsworth Townsley, come here. So Cheers. lovely to see you. Fabulous, darling. Now, Levingsworth's going to help me cook my little Cajun cuisine, but he'll also be sharing scenes from his latest Halloween play, straight from Broadway, Hollywood Slasher. It's slash, uh. Slash, uh. 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 <laughs> okay. That's fabulous. That's what I love about Levingsworth. He's mm. an actor. Very entertaining. So, let's take a look at the first clip from his musical that you're going to run, 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 run to see. But remember, you only have days before Halloween. We'll be back with some Cajun cuisine. We've got the eye of Newt, don't we, Levingsworth? Oh, yes. I like your big blue eyes, the way you touch your hair. I even love your smell and your soft dairy air. But I'd really be a winner if I could have your nipples for dinner. Red wine and roses are grand. I even love to pet little kitties. But the thing that's so pleasing to my hand is when I get a hold of your nice of fun titties Oh, love to see you walk and dancing in the rain But the image that keeps swirling round and round in my brain It might make me a sinner But I'd really love your nipples for dinner So, Levingsworth, who wrote this fabulous new musical that you're involved with? Well, I heard it's a Webber! Oh, yes. The famous the Timothy P Lloyd Webber. Is that the great, great, great grandnephew of the famous Webber? Yes. How a, old is he? Prodigy. Three. Three! Three. Oh, you are such a brave man to be on Broadway with a three year old writing your play! Let's get to the cooking. But first, we're going to actually start with a real Cajun. We throw it in. Whoops! Oh! Oh, the rigor mortis has set in! Shove it in there! Okay, what next? You're a famous cook, I've heard. Beans. Beans! Okay, let's measure it in my shoe. Okay, here we go. Here mm -hmm. we go. Mm-hmm. How about a little fingernail? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mm. Lovely. Has a booger in it still. Lovely. What else do we have? Oh, we have to put a little ketchup. Yes, the whole thing. Let's dump it in. And how about an onion? You know Cajuns love their onions. Oh, 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 no, no, no. What? It's got to be organic. Organic? Organ okay. Organic. <laughs> organic. Semantics. Oh, this is going to be delicious. In the meantime, we've got some puppy love and we've got another scene! Because Levingsworth Townsley wants something to share with you. This is a story about how I met the girl I loved and how I lost her because I was a fool. You guys pulled up in that really rocking van, but I didn't know who I am. So I started acting kind of shy and weird. I hid in the forest because I love you, girl. But then everybody started making fun of me. I kind of cracked a little and I killed them one or three. That's how it goes. Cause I grew up in the woods. I ain't got no friends but animals. And that's how it works out here in the woods. We just kill people, girl. I want you to be mine. And I just don't know how to say it cause I wasn't educated. My mom got a head cut off. You know that slasher. Slash up. Uh, Levingsworth Townsley is fabulous. How did you prepare for such characters? 
I mean, you're singing. Who, who was your mentor? Well, I hung out a lot with Lindsay Lohan. Oh, she's so yesterday. I thought you would have been singing with Kim or Chloe or Lamar or somebody in the Kardashian or, or what's the one that's the girl boy? <laughs> Kate. <laughs> Caitlin. Caitlin. <laughs> Could you just throw this rat in with the Cajun, please? I will do that. And you know what? There's no good Cajun meal without a lot, a lot, a lot of caffeine. Where is that eye of Newt? Oh, here it is. Put the puppy in there. Put the puppy juice in there. Just a little poopies. Oh, you said puppy. Oh, the poopy's fine. We'll be back with more Cajun cuisine after this next scene from Slasher! Slasher. I tried to touch a cheek, but there wasn't one there. I reached for your hand, but I only got it. I love you the more so that you're just a torso. No arms, no legs, no problem for me. We go out dancing, I hold you real tight People point at us and they say, what a sight I love you the more so, you're just a torso And that's okay with me Even though you have no limbs. Oh, you caught us! But that Levings would tell me he's so sexy. Well, we have one, one more little final surprise from Levingsworth's clips. In the meantime, more beans with the rats. They're all good. You come back. We're cooking up that Cajun like you've never done. We're going to spice it up. And then he's going to be doing his next song. I love your head in my soup. I want a human head in my soup. Eyeballs, lips, I taste it too. I want a human head in my soup, especially if it's you. I'd love a human head in my soup. Fingers and ears are tasty too. I want a human head in my soup, especially if it's you. Levingsworth. Thank you so much for stopping by. Is this not the best Cajun I've ever cooked? Delightful. Would you like a little nibble of the fingernail? Still has the book in it. Mmm. Mm. Anyway, love I, it. I wish you good luck. You only have a half more day of your show. In the meantime, I love that song, Head in My Soup. I can just hum it and dance to Put your head in my soup, put your head in my soup, just your head in my soup, and your limbs too. Okay, we'll be back next Halloween with more Ron Vira and Levingsworth. Enjoy, go cook up your own Cajun. Go to rondashir.com to actually get the ingredients and the recipe. Mmm, cheers, happy Halloween. <laughs>